There are just some performers who know how to entertain, whether it's in a crowded, rowdy bar or at a convention hall filled with professionals. In the Flathead Valley, John Dunnigan knows the notes and more than a few jokes. His musical skills are legendary, and so is that sense of humor. Jill Valley and photographer James Rafferty spent the last few months getting to know him to learn what makes him special. It certainly didn't take too long to figure out. I got a peaceful, easy feeling. It is a warm and smoky summer evening in Whitefish, Montana. And I know you won't let me The streets are filled with tourists and locals strolling along the sidewalks looking for a meal or listening for music. They've come to the right place. Good to see you here. On this night, I love that one. they crowd into a one. back patio at the Craggy Range Bar and Grill. That's what it was. It's where 64-year-old right John Dunnigan is tuning up for his bi-weekly show. He's considered by many the Jimmy Buffett of the Flathead Valley. Call Wasted Away Again in Margaritaville. You can sing along if you want, although it's the middle of the afternoon. Nobody does it. I don't care. Here we go. Most of those here tonight. Some people claim that there's a woman to blame. We're all going to Disneyland. And I know. Are here to hear him. It's my own dang fault. He's just sincere and engages with the audience, so it's hard not to have a good time. And if we drink enough, we'll dance. Goes like this. Even the staff request the patio section when they know he's on stage that night. I could be having the worst day of my life and I could come in and John could be working and he'll make it all better because not only does he give us amazing music, but he always makes us laugh. We're going to Mustang Ranch in Nevada. He makes connections when he's on stage. Maybe it's just a glance or a smile or a tip of a glass. <laughs> this is the wagon wheel. But no like matter this. how crowded it gets in there, John makes people feel like he is there just to sing for them. I gotta keep a move on. Thanks, you guys. I'll do one more song. He's a musician's musician with his guitars and banjo and harmonica combined with quick wit and humor. I'm thinking one word next winter. One word. Arizona. He's been a singer-songwriter before that was even a thing. This is what I want to be. I want to be me and I want to do this, this solo acoustic thing. But there wasn't that market for it like it is now. In the early 80s, there was very few people doing what I do right now in the Flathead Valley. I mean, like none. Just nobody doing this. Everybody was in bands, maybe a, a few duos around, but not the solo guy. Now there's, oh my gosh, I bet in Whitefish there's 25 solo artists in this town right now. He's quick-witted in person. Wow, you guys are so well-behaved tonight. I just can't believe it. And on stage, so fans never know quite what they're going to get at a John Dunnigan show. You guys are hanging out with the heavyweights tonight, man. But they interact with him like an old friend. So quick, somebody put this in the back of my car so he doesn't... <laughs> Cheering and laughing, dancing, yelling out requests. So this is a, a Robin Ford song. Robin. He puts his all into each performance, reading the crowd and giving them what they want. Oh, I think they like the spontaneity of, of me and the fact that I, I don't ever have a song list. I never do the same. I do the, a lot of the same songs as some of the bartenders can probably attest to, but uh, I just let it go wherever, you know, the, wherever the crowd wants to kind of go, I'll go. And sometimes it's, you know, it's me leading them, but quite often it's them leading me too, so I never know who's push and pull kind of deal. Thank you all very much. Wow, thanks you guys. What, a, what an unbelievably fun.